How to import accounts and contacts on Salesforce. Now, this video is going to be a complete step-by-step -step tutorial. So if you follow along by the end of this video, you will be able to import accounts and contacts into your Salesforce account. Okay, so to do this, you first of all want to load up Salesforce right here and go ahead and sign in. Now, once you have signed in, guys, uh, you will be taken over to a screen that looks like this. So just click on accounts right here at the top. And then you will be able to see once this loads up in the very top right corner over here, it says import. So go ahead and click into this and this is going to load you up into this import screen and it says what kind of data are you importing? So click on accounts and contacts. It says what do you want to do? Uh, we can click on add new record, update existing records or add new and update existing records. So choose one of these. I'm just going to go for add new record and then it basically says right here guys, where is your data located? So I recommend doing this just with a standard CSV file, uh, which if you go to one of your email autoresponders or your current CRM tool, you should be able to get a downloadable CSV file. Uh, I will just show you an example of this uh, CSV. So if I just go ahead and drag one of these in, you can see that if I drag a CSV file in, you can see that this is now dragged in right here. And once that is done, we can click on next. As you can see right here, your import will include two map field, 38 unmap field, that is fine, start import. And just right here guys, you can see that that has now started. So in a few seconds, you will be able to see that this is going to load up into accounts and contacts. And these will start coming through in a few seconds. As you can see guys, that has now loaded in and <laughs> I'm just going to go ahead and blur all of this to not give away any uh, private information. But that is how you can import accounts and contacts on Salesforce.